Welcome to Rory Academy YouTube channel where we present information that helps you improve your understanding and knowledge about power electronics technology. Insulators and semiconductors. Electrical current will flow in a material if there are charge carriers, usually electrons, in the material that are free to move in response to an applied electric field. The number of free carriers in various materials varies over an extraordinarily wide range. In metals such as copper or silver, the free electron density is very high, whereas in insulators such as quartz or aluminium oxide, the free electron density is very low. The number of free carriers in various materials varies over an extraordinarily wide range. In metals or insulator, the free carrier density is a constant of the material and cannot be changed to any significant degree. A material such as silicon or gallium arsenide, which has a free carrier density intermediate between that of an insulator and a metal, is termed a semiconductor. A free carrier density intermediate between that of an insulator and a metal is termed a semiconductor. In a semiconductor the free carrier density can be changed by orders of magnitude either by introduction of impurities into the material or by the application of electric fields to appropriate semiconductor structure. Thank you for watching and kindly subscribe to this channel for your weekly videos.